Howdy everyone, welcome back to Zeman Outdoors. Today on Skillet Sundays, we're going to be making chicken parmesan in a cast iron skillet. So what you're gonna need for this is about a pound to a pound and a half of chicken breasts, and you'll wanna pound it down or butterfly it to get it to be about a half inch or so in thickness. You'll need some Parmesan cheese, some mozzarella cheese, two eggs, some vegetable oil, marinara sauce, panko breadcrumbs, flour, and then some seasonings of choice. I have salt and pepper, and then I have the Everglades original seasoning. So let's go ahead and get started cooking. Before you start, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and preheat the oven at 400. Next, you'll take half a cup of flour and put it in a bowl. Add a little bit of salt and pepper to that. Next, you want to crack two eggs and then beat those. Then you want to take two cups of your breadcrumbs. And I just got the plain panko breadcrumbs because I'll be seasoning it myself. You want to add about a tablespoon to, a, to almost two tablespoons of seasoning here. I'm using the Everglades original. And then the last thing you'll add to this bowl is a fourth a cup of Parmesan cheese. And then you'll mix that together. At this point, you wanna go ahead and heat your oil in your cast iron skillet. So you'll need to take your vegetable oil and fill the bottom of the cast iron skillet to about a quarter of an inch of vegetable oil and heat over medium high heat. For the chicken now, you're going to first put it in the flour and you'll dredge it through the flour, then through the egg wash, and then lastly, through the bread. Bowl. Before you start frying the chicken, you'll want to go ahead and get a good layer of marinara in a pan here. Now that the oil is nice and hot, we're going to go ahead and fry the chicken for about one or two minutes on each side until it's nice golden brown. Next, you're going to take the rest of your marinara and just kind of pour it over the top. You can take a spoon and even it out. And then you want to take some fresh mozzarella. Followed by some Parmesan. And you'll want to stick this in the oven for about 10 to 15 minutes until the chicken's cooked all the way through. And there's another successful skillet sundae. Bon appetit! 